been frustrating all day and they've had quite a few of these issues coming up today. Friends! I woke up in Tulum today and I'm so blessed to be here. It's gonna be a great time and I'm gonna take you along with me. Is this? I've always dreamt of places like this. And then there's a little outdoor area. I'm here with friends and we're gonna be switching to a different spot today. The ATV is not working and we need to go to town to get Wi-Fi because American delayed my luggage and put it on another flight. You know what? This is an adventure. There is no one here, but we're trying to sit down and figure out my bag situation. It's so cute everywhere. This is the price of parking. Parking costs two ice creams. Two ice creams for two minutes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> salty taste. <laughs> to go see Rufus. I decided to kind of stay in, have a low key night. I think I'm gonna just gonna go walk down the street, pop into a little spot, grab a cocktail, and then come back home. I still wanted to show you my dress. So this is one that I upcycled. I made the back a little cowl. Let's ignore the fact that I fell asleep today and napped on a day bed. Let's forget about that. Then I wanted to do these orange earrings and I got them from TJ Maxx, but they're by Zara. And I thought they were really fun. A little bit of a little bit of contrast, a little flower. Instead of a flower in the hair, flower earrings. Then I have to catch a flight. Then I have to leave here at 7 a.m. because it takes two hours to drive out of Tulum to get to the Cancun airport. Soon though, there will be direct flights, and that's exciting from American. <laughs> rough look at this look at these bug bites it's almost 7 a.m i just want to sleep i have to get back to life and work but i want to show you the most amazing sunrise <laughs> going to a birthday that one of my friends invited me to and this is this is my train outfit this lavish alice dress haven't even unpacked but 
Let's go. I've never seen a self coat check. Thank God I have my scarf so I know what's mine because they all look the same. ready to go to my first ever hot yoga class. I'm excited. I have heard that you get a headache after sometimes. I don't know. My friend invited me. She says that I should drink a lot of water before. I feel like such a beauty influencer. This is from Merit. Makeup you can live in. This is vegan, cruelty free, and skin centric. They sent me this little bag and I forgot what I picked out. I'm going to test it before hot yoga and I don't think it's a good idea, but I'm still doing it. I have the Flush Balm in Après. I have the Day Glow Highlighting Balm in Citrine. Sounds very French. Citrine? I'm not sure. I have the Shade Slick Gelé Tinted Lip Oil in Maraschino. The Lightweight Lipstick in Millennial because I am one. Merit on the front. Beautiful. I put on a little bit of tinted moisturizer. I look like a doll, like a nutcracker or something. Rub the hand. This looks pretty natural. Here's our highlighting stick. I don't know where to put. Oh, wow. Okay, wait. This looks like real. I have oily skin, and sometimes I think I'm like, wow, the oiliness of my skin can be actually pretty if it were placed in the right spot. This is how my skin looks when it's oily, but like purposeful. This feels so light. I've never, I've actually never had a stick highlighter that felt like this. Here's the lipstick. I was so afraid of the colors when I looked on the website. Actually, this is quite sheer with a bit of color. So really pretty, but now I kind of wish I would have gone a little bit darker. I want to try the lip oil by itself. So I took that off. All right. Once again, not very pigmented. I was so afraid of this color. And now I'm like, I should have gone darker. I'm gonna go back to my usual lip scenario. So I'm gonna put a little bit, a little bit of liner on and then I'm gonna try this. I feel like this is more in my comfort zone. I just need a little. I'm gonna get sweaty, so it's kind of pointless probably. I'm gonna get my stuff together, grab a change of clothes. Let's go to hot yoga. I just finished my first hot yoga class at Yoga Spark. My friend Samantha invited me because she's also an instructor there. Hi followers! <laughs> and I'm super excited. So you teach there, right? Yes. Yeah. Thursday night, 7 p.m. Yeah. Blacklight class. Yeah. Okay. And where can people find info? Like where can they follow you? At Hey Samantha Bose on Instagram. Whether you live in New York or you're visiting, go take a class if you're available. And then we're here now at Old Days, Farm to Table, I feel that. Okay, I'll show you guys what we order, but it's so cute here. Look at that. I got the, the Reboot, it's the only one they have today. Oh, they brought me a little glass too. I got the veggie, oh this power veggie sandwich, but I, I got no carrots, because carrots on a sandwich is weird to me, and I added chicken. And then I just got the burrata toast, so I wanted something light. That was so fun, and now we go home and we record the Miss America recap. I'm going to dinner with Dana at the Ready Rooftop. They're doing a ski chalet thing, and Dana wanted to do the mob wife aesthetic, and this is what I came up with. Actually, my Pinterest inspo does not involve the leopard, but I'm just kind of feeling it, so I'm gonna bring it. Look, at, it's vintage, actually. So this is vintage, actually, yeah. It's all, the whole top of me is vintage thrifted. And then these pants were from a sample sale. And then my Zara boots, I told you I would wear them a lot. I got them from Poshmark. We're back, here with Dana. She made me dress up for here. 